All right, I've headed to my kitchen for wrap removal. Um, so what I'm gonna do is I'll just kind of talk you through the process and then I'll show you how I remove my wraps. Uh, pretty much the materials you need are going to be just regular non-acetone nail polish remover. And personally, I like to keep it in the cap and I'll just fill the cap about halfway full. Um, you will need a cuticle pusher. Um, this is like an orange stick. And in order to remove your wraps, what you're gonna wanna do is kind of loosen up one edge so I've had a little teeny bubble there, so I can just kind of use my orange stick to kind of lift it a little bit. Then I will dip it into the nail polish remover for a second. And then I'll go back. I wear a base coat underneath my nail wraps, and I feel like that really helps a lot, especially with removal. So then I just kind of slide and peel, and then I'll dip it again. You just want to get the nail polish remover underneath the wrap so that it'll start to kind of melt away. Again, just kind of peeling off. I'm not using very much pressure. I'm just kind of sliding off as I go. And it's pretty, pretty easy. Now, since this was a sparkle or a luster, there's a little bit of that sticky polish or the sticky um, sparkle layer still on my fingernails, but you see it comes, pretty much comes right off. But anyway, what I like to do is I'll dip it one more time and then I'll just take my fingernail backwards across the paper towel and then my wrap is off nice and clean. You also can use oil and those little teeth flossers. And so if you prefer to use like um, olive oil or coconut oil, you can soak your nails in that and then just kind of remove them and peel them the same way. You just don't wanna reapply your new wraps immediately because there's still a lot of oils that kind of gets trapped on your nails. But I'll talk about nail prep in just a second.